Hey Bachikas, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a mini Dollar Tree haul for you because I went to Dollar Tree today just to like stop and kind of like see what they had and they are starting to put out more of their Halloween stuff slowly though. Slowly but surely. But it's because they're paying attention to the fall first I think. They always do that like fall, Halloween, and then Thanksgiving, which is the same thing as fall, but that's what stores tend to do is what I noticed. So anyways, I'm just going to show you a few things I got today. Um, I got some juices because the kids were running out of their juice. I get them like one flavored drink a week that they only get to drink a little bit at dinner because I don't like to let them drink flavored sugary drinks all day long because then they avoid drinking water because all they want is the sugar. So I only let them drink like this much at dinner, but they were running low. And honestly, I wanted something with dinner and I saw these and I was like, I'm gonna try them. I actually forgot to check if there was food coloring. Okay, thankfully there is no food coloring in these. That was close. I forgot to check in store. Usually I'm like super like on the ingredients. But anyways, these are the old orchard healthy balance juices and they always have these at Dollar Tree in like a bunch of different flavors. So today I decided to pick up apple cranberry and um, the reason why I chose this is because it's reduced sugar and it is yeah one sugar per serving, 10 calories and two carbs. So it's not as bad as like a full on um, what do you call it? Like a sugary, fakey juice. <laughs> I mean, this only contains 5% juice, but it's just less sugar. So I figured mm, it's a little bit better, a little bit better. It's not perfect. Okay. I'm not saying this is the most perfect juice to buy. I think perfect is like cold press, like one ingredient juice, but those are, those are really expensive, really expensive. So I, I'm doing my best here because I've been on a budget. So I also got the white grape strawberry flavor and this one has two grams of sugar per serving three carbs and 10 calories so like i don't know if you're watching your weight or something uh these would be really good because super good macros i have a couple more food things and then i'll show you my halloween thing that i picked up so i got these i've tried these before i just felt like getting a snack so i actually got two of them but me and the kids just ate one of them because they only come with like this much so just keep that in mind um but me and the kids finished the first pack with our lunch so these are the munch rights apple cinnamon flavor baked puffs and these are so tasty you guys if you like the taco bell cinnamon twists which i'm obsessed with you will like these and this is healthier than those so these are actually um zero trans fat gluten-free no nuts kosher no msg and they are vegan they are plant-based so this is a great plant-based snack and you guys know i've been eating plant-based i again i'm not perfect and i don't like labels but i base i eat pretty plant i eat plant-based um anyways what i liked about these as well is there's very little ingredients i know you guys probably can't see so there's cornmeal vegetable oil sugar cinnamon apple powder and salt and that's it and again vegetable vegetable oil is not the best um but what how often do i have these things you know you just have to like limit i guess also got some ketchup because i'm gonna be grocery shopping in two days so i was at dollar tree and i saw the full size so i was like i might as well pick it up here because um we were completely out of ketchup this is brand name full size you guys 20 ounces for a dollar 25 can't beat that and then i got some vanilla extract because i'm actually about to bake some cookies right after i finish this and okay so there's two vanilla extracts at dollar tree there's the big bottle and it's like imitation vanilla that is not good it's just water sugar and caramel coloring it's actually not vanilla extract um but i did see on somebody's i don't know if it was like youtube or tiktok but she was like if you're gonna shop at dollar tree choose this one because it's better than the other one and vanilla extract is super expensive super expensive and i've been making a lot of my own homemade baked goods so i go through it a lot so i just wanted to try this and see um because it was a dollar 25 it's by bakersfield and it's this pure vanilla extract in the ingredients it says vanilla extract which is a great sign because the other one at dollar tree the first ingredient is water um so vanilla extract uh ethyl alcohol water glycerin sugar and vanilla oleoresin 
I don't know what that means. But anyways, it looked pretty promising. So let me see. I bet you the bottle's like so tiny. Yeah. This will get me maybe like four batches of cookies. I mean, not bad. And yeah, I don't know why we were just like in the food section today. I didn't see anything else really exciting. So like when I went to the food section, I saw a bunch of new things and I was like, cool. Um, so I saw Halloween like baked goods decorations and i was like whoa that's so cool i've never seen that at dollar tree let me know if you've seen that in previous uh previous years i have not so this is the same brand as the vanilla extract it's called bakersfield sprinkle halloween so that's awesome to get for a dollar 25 i was like heck yeah i can make some cupcakes or cookies with these and then they had candy eyeballs. What? What? Like what even? I just thought that was so cool. It's by the brand Twinkle Candy Eyeballs Regular. So you can make like little creepy desserts for Halloween. So I figured I would get that and me and the kids would have some fun when it gets closer to Halloween. And the last thing that I got was Halloween. Yay, I'm so excited. This is like the first kind of like decor like real decor halloween stuff that they put out at my dollar tree because right now they just have like all the arts and crafts and maybe a candle and that's what they have halloween right now floral arts and crafts and like one decor so they finally brought these out and i'm so excited i can't wait to go check back next week to see what they have um i saw two different styles of this the other one is uh black on the front and the back this is just the back and it's like spider webs all over and talks about witches and stuff like that this one says witch spells 31 and boo i just liked the way that this one looked better it's little witches on a broom and then the jack-o-lanterns have the little witch hats and then i got the matching towel i don't like dollar tree's towels because they're microfiber and i feel like they don't really grab up moisture i will simply be using this for decoration because I don't like these towels for actually using it as a hand towel. But I wanted to buy it because um, I do have more Halloween towels. It's not like I don't have any Halloween towels, I do. But you have to wash them, you know? So you need more to change them out. And I'm obsessed with Halloween. I'm gonna decorate very soon. I'm not even playing with y'all. I know that you, some of you won't like to hear that because you're not done with summer, but I'm sorry. I'm gonna be decorating probably at the end of August, maybe middle of August, we'll see. Anyways, that is all I picked up today at Dollar Tree. Um, so I hope you guys liked it. I know it was small, but I'll see you guys in the next video.